Yo, what is up gamers, it's your boy Dino, welcome back to another video here on the channel. In today's video guys, I'm the first time posting this Beth method to consoles merge glitch uh, and how to get the white, blue, red and so forth coloured helmets in GT5 Online, okay? So I'll run through the requirements that you'll need, you'll need to have two consoles, you'll need to have netcut which is all linked in the description. If you don't have two consoles, you can have a friend who's really trusted. Alright, to do this glitch in your slot 1, you'll need to have an outfit with either the orange, pink, purple or green bulletproof helmet and in slot 2 an outfit that you want to go ahead and put the, the uh, white, red or whatever helmet you are transferring over onto the outfit. Alright so obviously in my slot 1 you've got my orange helmet, in my slot 2 I've got my spades um, dome helmet which then is the white bulletproof helmet one transferred over from doing the Beth glitch. So all the um, helmets are linked below. Uh, what helmet is which and which colour it is transferred over from console to console, okay? Uh, if you don't know what that is, um, go to the comment section as well, that'll be at the pinned one for you and uh, you should be sorted to go. Also, like I said, you will need to have netcut with this, that'll be linked in the description, it is completely free and you'll need to find your IP address for your console 1 or console 2. Alright, so this glitch is really straightforward, uh, it does get a little bit of practice to get to know it, uh, but I did this for an hour straight, didn't hit it, and then start to get used to the glitch and then start doing it. Alright, so first of all you want to go ahead and head to your second um, outfit which is this one here with the helmet on. Uh, you want to go ahead and put a parachute and some glasses on and get that save. Once you've got the orange save, you want to go ahead and go to your computer, go to the netcode and then disconnect your internet while your IP address is on your console. Alright, so once you've gone ahead and done that, you can then head over to your second console which should be in story mode already and go straight to an invite only session while logging into your account. Now what is happening in the background gameplay, if you've got two monitors or two PCs or whatever it is you're using, uh, as you see on your main console you'll still be in an on by lonely session, just AFK, while loading into a second console on your main account as well. So once you're on your second console, go ahead and pull up your interaction menu as fast as you can, go to style and change to the orange bulletproof helmet and then go ahead and remove your glasses. With that being said then, you'll get an orange circle, hold down your D-pad and go to a single player character. From there, go back to your netcode and reconnect your internet. Once you're back on your internet reconnecting, go back to your console 1, stay as out for here, take off the parachute and the glasses as fast as you can, and from mid and do then, give it a second or two, and you will then get kicked from a session saying your account has been logged in on a different console. Straightforward and straight and easy. Uh, all components, glitches, and all stuff like that is linked in the description. Uh, go ahead and check out the website for merge to merge stuff, okay? So now you're still on your console 1, you go ahead and sign back into your main online GTA account, go back to GTA, you will get an alert screen just like this, and then you will load into a single player session. With that being said, don't worry about it, once you load back into a single player session as fast as you can, start online invite only session. And then when you do go ahead and proceed to an invite only session, when you do spawn in, you will have the coloured outfit or coloured bulletproof helmet that you did require over the dome outfit itself from console 1 at the beginning. So here I've got the white outfit now and this is what it looks like. So there we go guys, that is it for today's tutorial. I hope you did enjoy. If you have any questions please head over to my Discord linked in the top of the description and on the comment section. Uh, if you have any personal information at all head over to my Twitter, contact me on there, I'll reply either way. But other than that guys, again, have any questions let me know, I'll try and help you out as much as I can. And if you guys want to join the crew and get some modded colours, let me know. That is also linked in the description below as well. But tonight, some guys, it's your boy Dino. Thank you so much for watching. Enjoy the helmets, and I'll see you in the very, very next one. Peace out, homies.